scegliere una lingua, italiano o inglese. Pong Pong's Learning Adventure Animals Please choose a character whose progress will be saved. The beautiful Wonder Village is located in a far away forest. A clever and lovely pig, Pong Pong, lived there happily. One day, everything changed suddenly. The forest became dry and the villagers were all sick. Pong Pong was lost and alone. How could this happen? Oh, what should I do? I have a good idea. The spirit of trees will certainly know how to save my village. After walking for three days, Pong Pong finally came to the depths of the forest. He found the spirit of trees at last. Pong Pong told the spirit of trees about what had happened in his village in detail. The cause of the problem is that people have ruined the natural environment. Pong Pong, you must pass through Fantasy Woods to come to the Dream Ocean. You have to find the fairy shell in the Dream Ocean and ask her to give you a magic pearl to save your village. But a lot of difficulties are waiting on the way. Only the wisest person can reach the destination. No matter how difficult, I will go! Oh, great. You are the bravest child. Pong Pong, let me give you a hand. <laughs> Click here. You can go into the House of Wisdom to get more knowledge before you set off. Click here to start the journey. Remember to carry wise fruit with you or you can't go anywhere. You need to find the instructions and the questions hidden on the way. Only when you answer each of the questions correctly can you reach the dream ocean. Pong Pong, good luck to you. Go, go, go! Which way should I go? Right, I'll ask Mr. Ock. <coughs> um, he might know where to go. Good day, Mr. Ock. I am Pong Pong from Wonder Village. Do you know which way leads to the Dream Ocean? If you want to reach the Dream Ocean, first you must pass through Fantasy Woods. To get to Fantasy Woods, you have to take the ladder and find Mr. Rabbit. You need to invite Mr. Rabbit to accompany you to see Sister Big Bird. Then you must ask Sister Big Bird to lead you to Fantasy Woods. Oh, I see. Thank you, Mr. Ox. Mm, pong Pong, I'll give you the ladder if you answer my question correctly. If not, you'll lose one life nut. Are you willing to take the challenge? Yes, no. Will the ox be angry at the sight of red? One, the ox becomes angry at the sight of something waving, but in fact, it can't distinguish colors. Two, the color red can arouse in the ox a strong consciousness of danger. Three, the ox is angered because it sees the keen sword in the hand of the matador. You are great! You can have the ladder now. Where is 
the little rabbit. Birds can fly. That's because they all have a pair of wings. Fantasy Woods, would you? I want to save my village. Pong Pong, give me the right answer. Then I'll accompany you to ask Sister Big Bird to lead you to Fantasy Woods. Do you want to take the challenge? Yes, no. Why doesn't the rabbit eat the grass around its den? One, it will eat the grass if it tastes delicious. Mmm, yummy. Two, the grass near the den usually tastes bad black. Three, the rabbit needs a place to hide itself. You are terrific! I'll lead you to Sister Big Bird right now. My favorite carrots, I'm crazy about them. <laughs> Hurry up, let's visit Sister Big Bird. She must be Sister Big Bird, I think. Cross it. I better ask Puppy. Puppy, could you tell me how to cross the ditch? I am dead hungry. Get me something to eat immediately. Boss, please give me a bone. I am too busy right now. After you distribute each of these things on the table to the right animals, I'll give you a bone. Please, fetch me the food I ordered. 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 Me the food I ordered. Please fetch me the food I ordered. 
Please. Ooh, thank you. It's so kind of you, but you still have to answer my question first. After that, I'll tell you the method. Do you want to take the test? Yes, no. Why is the tip of a dog's nose always wet? One, because dogs lack sweat glands. They depend on their noses to help radiate heat. Two, it must secrete mucus to moisten its olfactory cells. Three, if a dog's nose becomes dry, it means the dog is thirsty. Wonderful! That's right! Fill in the ditch with the stones. Then you can cross the ditch easily. Which way should I go? I am so sorry. I didn't mean it. You silly fool! Oh! <laughs> Mr. Bear, how can I go to the Dream Ocean? You want to go to the Dream Ocean? You have to pass my test first. Answer my question and I'll show you the way. Are you ready to take my test? Yes, no. How can a koala sleep in a tree without fear of falling out? One, it can bind stiff branches and support its body with its hind limbs. Two, it stands on a branch, embracing it tightly. Three, something like suction cups on the soles of its feet can grip the tree. You are 100% correct. I'll do you a favor. I need to remind you of something. There is a river a little further on. You can't cross the river unless you get the treasure bag from Brother Pig. Without it, it's impossible to cross the river. I seem to be on the land of Brother Boar. I am the meanest Brother Boar! Brother Boar, how can I go to the Dream Ocean? If you want to go to the Dream Ocean, you have to pass my test. You will receive my help if you pass the test. Yes. Why do quills grow all over the body of the porcupine? One, the quills make the porcupine look beautiful. Two, the quills help the porcupine to resist its enemies. Three, the quills can be used by the porcupine to prey on little animals. Here's the treasure bag for you! Brother Boar, may I ask what on earth the treasure bag can do? When you go a little further, you'll see a river. When you have trouble crossing the river, just open the treasure bag. At that time, you'll have no trouble at all. <laughs> No, you are wrong. A flying squirrel cannot fly. He is gliding with the help of the mucous membrane on his skin.
The skunk is letting out stink gas! Can I cross a river as wide as this? Wow, frogs can live both on land and in water. They are amphibian. Frog, would you please help me to cross the river? You want to cross the river? That's quite easy. I'll carry you across the river if you give me the right answer to my question. Do you want to take the challenge? Yes, no. Why doesn't the tail of the tadpole disappear after it grows up? One, the tail can't easily be found because it has grown smaller. Two, it degenerated because it's useless. Three, it changes into the hind legs of the frog. Oh, correct. Jump on my back, I'll carry you across. It is terribly dark here. Help! Help! It's going to blow up! You have to answer my question, or you can't go any further. Are you going to answer my question? Yes, no. Is a bat a kind of bird? One, no, its predecessor is a mouse. Two, yes because it has wings. Three, it's a kind of mammal instead of a bird. Perfect, now I can lead you out of here. Ah! What a spectacular place. Sister Snake, I want to go to the Dream Ocean. Could you help me? I'll give you a magic Dragon Ball if you answer me correctly. Using the magic Dragon Ball, you can dive into the sea like a fish. Do you want to answer the question? Yes, no. How can a snake crawl so quickly without legs? One, the skin can secrete mucus to increase the speed of crawling. Two, the outside scales can erect when crawling in the shape of an S. Three, crawling in the shape of the letter S can enhance power and traction. Here is the magic dragon ball. Take it with you, and you can dive into the deepest sea.
Why, do you want to dive into the dream ocean? If you give me the right answer, I'll transform you into a fish. Will you? Yes, no. Why do seagulls like to fly alongside ocean-going vessels? One, it can be absorbed in flying instead of alerting other animals. Two, it can take advantage of the airflow formed by the passage of ocean-going vessels to save energy in flight. Three, it can learn directions. Terrific! You have the correct answer. Give me the magic dragon ball now, and I'll transform you into a fish. If you don't have it, you have to go back to Sister Snake and fetch the magic dragon ball first. See you then! One question, I'll give you a treasure, and it will do you a great big favor in the future. Yes, no. How does the clam eat things without a mouth? One, it opens its shell for eating. Two, it uses little pores to take plankton in as food. Three, it keeps its life by accidentally opening its shell to swallow large amounts of food. Yes, perfect. You are right. Here's the gift for you. The shell will protect you if you encounter an electric eel on your way. If you want me to help you, you need to give a good answer. If you have the right answer, I'll offer you a treasure. If not, I am afraid your future is uncertain. Yes, no. Is there a lot of salt in the bodies of seawater fish? One, no. Salt sorting cells can dispose unnecessary salt out of their bodies. Two, seawater doesn't have much salt, so there is not much salt left in their bodies. Three, fish have a special distinctive system to filter the salt out. Good answer! Take the fish gills as a token to prove you are a member of the sea world. Wherever you go, there will be sea creatures to help you. Oh, you are a 
puppy fish. Since you are a member of the sea world, I'll tell you how to find the fairy shell in case you pass my test. So, do you want to try? Yes. How can we judge the age of a fish from its scales? One, count the number of scales. Two, observe the size of the scales. Three, count the number of thinner pieces of fish scales. You have the wrong answer. I am sorry, but you've lost a life nut. I'll give you one more chance. Will you try another question? Yes, no. Can we determine the sex of a fish from its shape? One, yes, male fish have a brighter body color during mating season. Two, yes, the position of the stomach is different. Male left side, female right side. Three, no, they are the same. Very good, let me tell you. You must have the shell to protect you first. Then find a flash of lightning and a claw key to open the door. After that, you can see the fairy shell. Remember to take coral as a present. It's so terrible out here. Am I taking the wrong way? Ouch. You are a brave kid, and you've passed this test. Now, answer this question, and I'll send you a flash of lightning. If you answer correctly, the lightning can open the main gate to the fairy shell's home. Do you want to try this question? Yes. How is the numb fish able to release electricity? One, it has stronger electricity than other animals have. Two, it lives in the sea with electricity. Three, it can't release electricity. It releases a kind of venomous liquid that when touched produces an electric shock. You have the wrong answer. Oh, I am sorry, but you've lost a life nut. I'll give you one more chance. Will you try another question? Yes, no. How do jellyfish attack their enemy? One, with needle-shaped objects at the ends of their tentacles, which can excrete anesthetic. Two, with arista cells on their tentacles, which excrete poisonous liquid. Three, their tentacles will become as stiff as needles upon coming across the enemy. You are right! Hey! The flash is yours! The lantern fish, it's so bright. Beautiful sister coral, please give me a good bunch of coral. I want to give them to the fairy shell so that she will give me the magic pearl to save my village. You want the coral? No problem, as long as you answer the question. Would you like to answer the question? 
Yes, no. Why do glow flesh plump up the stomach? One, to frighten the enemy. Two, for beauty. Three, this is caused by the extremely huge flotation pocket in its body. Oh, the fairy shell likes Coral very much. Take this as a present. She will surely be willing to help you. This looks like the entrance. Mom, wait for me. <laughs> if you have the flash, you can use it to start the mechanism. The big claw will arise then. If you do not have the flash, you can do nothing but go home. <laughs> Hey, this land is mine. This road is mine, too. If you want to go through it, you have to answer my question. If the answer is correct, I'll give you another key. Do you want to have a try? Yes. Why can a crab only crawl sideways? One, this is safer because its eyes cannot look forward. Two, it will tangle itself up if it moves straight ahead. Three, its feet can only move up and down because there is no turning joint on its feet. Otherwise, you'll never be able to see her. Oh, do you want to answer the question? Yes, no. Is there blood in the body of a tunnel fish? One, no, it is a kind of animal without vertebrae. Two, there is, but the blood cannot be found easily. <laughs> because it is mixed in with black succus. Three, there is, but the blood is colorless because it lacks red pigment. You pass! <laughs> now you can come in, yeah! <laughs> I finally found you, Fairy Shell! Please give me your magic pearl to save my villagers. Thank you for the beautiful coral. Now, just answer my question correctly, and I will give you the magic pearl. Do you want to answer the question? Yes. Why are there pearls in a shell? One, because a special substance inside the shell will become a pearl after its death. Two, it can excrete pearl substance to surround material taken from outside to produce a pearl. Three, in fact, pearls are quite rare among shellfish. Wonderful! The magic pearl is here. You can take it now. You've got the magic pearl. And now, you should go to the North Pole, pass through the time tunnel, and go home.
take the magic pearl back to your village and they will be healthy again. But remember to tell them not to ruin the environment anymore. Let me give you a ride now. Get on my coral and fly towards the North Pole, pass through the time tunnel and go home. How chilly it is. <sighs> Can you let me enter the time tunnel and go home? Of course, as long as you answer my question, think it over. Yes, no. Why does the body color of the walrus change sometimes? One, as a chameleon, the walrus changes its body color depending on circumstances. Two, it's a delusion because the smooth skin of the walrus can reflect light. Three, it can adapt to the cold climate with its special body conformation. Good answer! I'll open the gate to the time tunnel right now! After passing through all difficulties, Pong Pong finally came back to Wonder Village. At last, Pong Pong used the magic pearl to save the whole village. Pong Pong, thank you so much for saving the village. All of the villagers and I present this award to you. Thank you. You are the silver medal hero in Wonder Village. You can choose to have it print out or not. 